one of the great tours. And now, Mercedes-Benz reckon they can put you in the seat of their brand new model for just $4,000. No more to pay. Here it is, the Mercedes-Benz of bicycles. It's got features that are more like a car than a bike. There's even a dashboard display and it's the world's first bike with automatic gears. onboard computer takes care of all eight gears by itself. Well, it's certainly an easy takeoff. The computer's automatically put the bike in the lowest gear. Yeah, and then as you speed up, you can feel the next gear kick in. So if I drop back a bit, there we've dropped down. Then we speed up, the, the computer knows I've sped up and the gear's automatically been shifted up. Very clever. A computer screen, Mercedes calls it the flight deck, displays gear changes, bike speed, and the current suspension setting. Hill climbing is so easy, you can do it again and again. That's the automatic gearbox there. And basically, the computer knows what speed you're traveling at, it works out the best gear for you, and automatically puts the bike in it. And the suspension is automatic as well. So if you're pedaling along on a you know, rough cobblestone path like this, it says, aha, you need a softer suspension, and automatically makes the adjustments through a computer connection to the suspension. Besides the famous name, it still looks like a pretty normal bike. That's because all the tech is hidden inside. So how do you make a fully automatic bike? Well, of course, you need a computer. That's what this bike has. The screen is here in the handlebars, and the computer itself is tucked away under here. But of course, for a computer, you need power. Now, there are no batteries with this bike. You generate the power yourself by pedaling. There's a little generator in the wheel. That generates the power. But also, it can store power. So when you say stopped at the traffic lights, the power doesn't cut out and the computer system shut down. There are three times more push bikes built in the world than cars. And Mercedes takes safety just as seriously, whether on four wheels or two. Even when you're not thinking about safety, the bike is. You know those high-end cars where the lights automatically switch on when things get dark? Well, the Smoover's got them as well. Even the lights are automatic on this bike. Just here is a tiny sensor that measures the ambient light. As soon as it gets dark, the lights automatically come on. And even the lights at the back are special. There's a brake light. In fact, the interesting thing is, the brake light doesn't come on when you put on the brake. What the all-knowing computer does is it monitors your speed. As soon as it detects that you've suddenly slowed down, the brake light automatically comes on. Now that's something even the best luxury cars don't have. This bike takes out the head work, but not the leg work. That's right, the Mercedes bike might come with all the latest extras, but you're still going to need good old-fashioned muscle power to get you from A to B.